Hello penguins, this is Draconic Rose and today I will teach you how you can download and play Curse Mod Packs using Linux. First, you will need a launcher of some sort. In this tutorial I will be using MultiMC. Go ahead and download it from the link below. I won't go into installation instructions for this tutorial. Next, you will need to head over to GitHub, link below, to download Portable Jim's Curse Pack Downloader. In my case, the version needed is Linux 64-bit tar.kz. And finally, download your mod pack of choice. In this tutorial, I will use the simple yet excellent Britannia Skyblock the mod pack the mod the mod pack. I will leave the download link below. Go ahead and unpack the curse pack downloader zip into a folder. Inside, you should find the curse pack downloader. Double click it. In some distros, you may find that nothing happens. That is because you are missing some dependencies and you can install them the following way. Open your terminal and type sudo apt-get install python3 tk Python 3 app there's and Python 3 requests. Press enter and input your password. Press Y when prompted. The dependencies should be installed. In my case, they are already installed and CursePack Downloader is working, so I will not go to installation again. Next, we will have to unpack your mod pack. So go ahead and do that. This folder will be temporary, so just do it wherever you can find it later. Now we can come back to CursePack Downloader and tell it where to find the manifest.json. Go ahead and browse to your temporary mod pack folder and select manifest.json. Press open, then download mods. The download process will begin. If you're using MultiMC, now is a good time to set up your instance. Open MultiMC and create a new instance. Name it and choose the vanilla version of the mod pack we'll be using. Don't worry, we will be installing Forge later. Next, right click your new instance and choose Edit Instance. You will see at the bottom here an option to install Forge. If your mod pack doesn't require a particular version, go ahead and install the recommended version. Now you are ready to put it all together. Right click your instance and select Instance Folder. This is where your mod pack will live. Go back to where you unzipped your mod pack and now you should have a Minecraft folder. Copy and paste it. And now you're done. To test it, you can launch your Minecraft instance and create a new world. I hope this tutorial is helpful to you. If you have any questions, please ask them in the comment section down below. If you would like to support me, you can do so by sending a couple of dollars my way to the Ko-Fi link in the description.